Hey everyone, this is Andrew with Pride Investigator Vice at PrideInvestigatorVicehQ.com. Um, I've got something to share with you today. It's regarding report writing, and typically when you when you write a report, you're going to be placing pictures in the report, or you're going to put information that you found off the internet in that report. Maybe you found something on the subject, and what I've always had to do is take a picture of the screen using print screen, and then take that photo and then crop it nicely and make it all pretty and then stick it into the report and it was pretty time consuming but my wife found something that she's been using well she found it and she told me about it thought it was pretty cool then I started using it and it saved me a ton of time it's called Snagit it's by TechSmith um, this allows you to quickly pull pictures or um, maybe website information uh, off the internet um, and it does it automatically for you. It literally crops it out and takes only what's on the web page for you. You don't have to um, worry about the admin bar above it or the Google search stuff or, or anything like that on it. And uh, also what it does, which is really cool, is it will literally scroll down for you and copy the entire page of a web page. You know, I'm doing a horrible explanation trying to explain it on here. Watch my little tutorial um, Snagit is is forty nine ninety five. Pretty reasonable for the amount of time time you're going to save and the amount that you're going to use it. You can use it for a bunch of other things, um, like uh, making tutorials, or um, I use it a lot for this for this website. Um, it also got a thirty day free trial. So and it's I have used the trial. There's no obligation. It gives you thirty days to use the full use of it. It's pretty cool, and then after I, the 30 days, I bought it because it was so amazing for me. So um, check it out, and uh, if you like it, great. Uh, make sure you like this video, and uh, I thank you for watching, and check out this little tutorial. I'll just show you briefly what I use it for. All righty, thanks. Okay, everybody, so here's my demonstration on, on just the few things that I promised you that I was going to show you. Um, one of the first things was is that... Um, Snagit will actually document everything on an entire web page. It'll scroll down for you and copy uh, or copy everything, whatever it does. It. It's not like a simple print screen function where if I took a, uh, did a, a screenshot, this is all I would see in that in that final screenshot. So so what I'll do is I open up the Snagit program and I'm going to click the scrolling window option and I'm going to press this red button right here. And what it does is it opens up this little orange thing down here. And I'm going to go ahead and press it. And right now, it's going to uh, capture the screenshot of the entire web page, just scrolling down by itself. And when it's done, it will um, it'll take all that that it's just copying right now, and it'll place it into a, uh, an ed editor, where I'm just going to go ahead and save it. And here it is. And if you can see here, this is the editor. I'm just going to open it up wider. It saved everything on that page. Scrolled all the way down to the bottom. And so I'm just going to go ahead and save it. And I'm going to go ahead and save it as a uh, as a PDF. So that way no one can mess with it. So here's my Snagit example. And I'm going to save it in there as a PDF. And... Uh, Okay, that's great. Then I'm going to shoot over here and just open it up to show you that <clears throat> this is what you would be able to print out for your client on their reports, or you'd be able to just enter it into a digital copy of the report. Either way, it's something that the client can see. Instead of just looking at a link uh, that's maybe um, embedded in, in the report, they can actually have it. And, and obviously, you can open up more pages and do the same thing on these things. So that's the first example. That impressed me a lot. But you might not be impressed yet so let me show you what else it has go ahead and close that go ahead and close that and so um, let's say you found a picture of your claimant or whoever it was um, and and you maybe found it on a web page look at this this is a web page so I want to just capture this picture so what I'm going to do is go back to my Snagit profile I'm going to go ahead and just click all in one this is what I typically use when I click to capture, and this thing will actually um, crop it automatically. You don't have to crop it 
it's I mean uh, you don't have to crop it after you you grab the picture so you can see that little circle right there I'm actually grabbing it right on the corner and I'm just gonna pan down here and it's gonna show me the little window again and boom done handsome fellow okay so I've saved it I'm gonna save it as a JPEG and that will be that incredibly easy incredibly easy probably fast now it's like well that's great Andrew you, you saved that now what are you gonna do with it well I usually when I pull pictures I want to stick them in my, my report right so I'm gonna close that and uh, minimize that there's too much stuff in my way here let me just open up the snagit examples there it is right I want to bring up my report I'm just gonna drag it in there now now I've got my picture of um, you know whatever was happening whatever I got it in there all right everybody here is my last example this is the one that I use most frequently and you probably will too once you find out how easy it is to use and this is where I grab a, a picture off my video with ease and then throw it in my report and I can do it multiple times and it just makes my life so much easier so picture this this is your video that you got today and uh, that's your claimant and he is doing some roller hockey and you know there's a moment where you want to capture <laughs> that's going to reflect a report entry and uh, so I just happen to know that that this guy's about to fall so I'm gonna go ahead and stop it once he does oh there he goes and I paused it and I'm gonna go ahead and get my snag it again it's already set up for an image and watch how cool this is when I move it over it figures out what frames I don't know I don't know how it does it but it does it and I'm just gonna pick the one with the with the guy falling so I pick it and I do like I did before in the other ones I save it I'm gonna go ahead and save it as a fall picture and save it in my folder here as a JPEG because I want to put it in my report and I'll just go ahead and minimize this stuff here and here's my report again and oh that looks like oh that was a spot right there right and I'm gonna go ahead and take my picture and put it in there and uh, there it is all I did was had to do was drag it I'm gonna go ahead and format this picture and just change the size of it real quick to 35% real quick and you know that's kind of small but I think you get the idea I can change it again and get it bigger and uh, that's basically it that is the one that I use it for the most that is the one that I can imagine you guys using it for frequently um, this is just an awesome program and I'm just I'm not even scratching the surface on what this program can do um, I'm just showing you the stuff that I use it for most frequently what I've been able to you know throw these things in my reports um, I think you guys will like it. Anyways, so long story short, I've got an affiliate link on my webpage if you guys want to use that to order this. Um, remember, it's got a 30-day 30 30 day trial, uh, so definitely take advantage of that. See all the cool things you can do with it. Uh, I can't imagine that you wouldn't want this, unless you've got something else that does the same thing. I can't imagine you wouldn't want this for uh, for yourself or for your investigators. Either way, it's a, it's a great investment. Um, I hope this helped you out. And I hope you were as impressed as I was. And uh, again, thank you guys again for watching these videos. Make sure to click the like button on this uh, YouTube video. Um, and leave any comments if you want. Um, that way so uh, more people can uh, find this video. And if they're private investigators or whoever, I mean, I can use this for whatever, uh, that they'll uh, be able to see this and find this. Alrighty, thank you guys. Have a great day. And I look forward to making another video for you soon. Thanks again.